Hey, how's it going cleaning business owners? My name is Alex. I am the co-founder of Scale My Cleaning Business. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to optimize and create your profiles online, just to have a good presence. And the reason that this is so important is because whether you're on the residential side or commercial side or both, your target customers or clients are going to be checking your presence online. So it's really just to build trust. Uh, they wanna make sure that you're good at what you do, you're professional, you have good reviews. And where that all starts is if you are new to all of this, uh, you're going to first start by creating your profiles uh, and then optimizing them. And after you've done that, then you can start actually creating systems. So with, if it's Google, uh, you know, you can invest in someone who does SEO. The team and I, we specialize in LinkedIn and Facebook. Uh, those are two very powerful systems, both uh, Facebook being for residential as well as LinkedIn being for commercial. And yeah, like I said, I mean, this is really the first step. So I'm going to be showing you Google My Business. It's very simple. Um, basically, if you don't already know, Google My Business is probably the biggest one out there. So anyone who's looking for a local janitorial or cleaning business near them, probably going to start by searching on Google. So and really what you want is to be one of the first ones that come up. And that does take time. And like I said, eventually you can invest in someone to help you get to the top, but really the first step is just creating your presence in the first place. First thing you're gonna do is go to google.com slash business, and then you're gonna go to manage now, and then you're gonna enter your company name. So I'll just make up a name. So we'll say Alex's cleaning business. All right, and then we're gonna go next. Commercial cat category, commercial cleaning. We can say commercial cleaning service. Uh, there's a couple other ones as well. Um, your location will appear. Yes, you definitely want that. Uh, let's say we're in the United States. All right, so here's the United States. And I'm just going to make up an address. Market Street, Philadelphia. That was just an office I used to work at. Uh, all right, next. So yeah, just put in your address and your... So make sure you, oh, by the way, when you put in your address, make sure you can have access to it for your mailing. Uh, it's super important. Um, Alex is cleaning. Uh, you can send a text message. So I'm actually gonna do this right now. So I'm sending a text message to myself. All right, so we're just gonna hit check. So it's already been verified. We're gonna hit start. All right, so you're just gonna add your hours of app, app, uh, operation. So for here, let's just say you're open eight to eight to five. And then you can just do that for all of the different ones. I'm just gonna save time, so I'm not gonna do that yet. But yeah, just add all of your working hours or opening hours. Uh, company description. So really just try to have a lot of keywords that you think people are going to search, be searching for and really just talk about your services. So talk about why uh, people want to use your cleaning business. Is it your reliability, your professionalism? Is it your how you are personal to your clients or your customers? So just think about all the different things about your company and then maybe just a little bit of background. Um, for right now, I'm just going to skip it. But for your sake, you definitely want to add this and you want to just do each different part. The reason you want to do each different part, Google looks for they want to make sure that you have a complete profile. Uh, there's others. There, there are other things uh, it does look for in terms of bringing you to the front of, front page of Google when people search for a cleaning business around you. Um, but this is definitely the first step. So, uh, adding photos of your company. So add some photos. Continue. All right. So a couple things. So you're going to want to add a couple photos, as many photos as you can. Uh, create a, actually you want to create a couple posts, you can update your status, add a button, you know, people can reserve or check in or buy more information is probably what you're going to be looking at, or even reserve if they want to reserve a time with you. And then you can just post. So I mean, there's different types of posts, events, products, for you, it's probably going to be an event or an offer. But yeah, I would recommend doing a couple posts. That's one thing Google books for. Uh, you have to verify this. So uh, more information, uh, you can look at this. So it's actually sending the the card, the postcard to this address. So this will this will be made, and then I'll say when it's sending over here. 
add a short name to the profile, add a description, add a logo. You wanna add all these different things that you can. Again, you can claim that ad credit. And then just go through each different thing. So this is just for the posting information. This is super important. You wanna add all of your locations, your service areas, uh, services, just fill all the stuff that you can on here. Tags, that's really good for, for Google to look for. There's another thing called Google Analytics. So I'm not really gonna go over that in this video, but that's something I would highly recommend installing. You can put it on your website, you can track people, you can see what the traffic looks like, and you can make adjustments and run ads uh, for those, those Google ads. You can add different custom services. Just go through all these different things. Go to your website, add your website. I'll be doing a different video on how to create and optimize your website. And that's pretty much it. So if you guys have any questions, feel, reach, feel free to reach out to us. We're more hap than happy to take a look, help you out. If you have any questions specifically, we will answer them.